13 Action News Update sponsored by Cox, bringing us closer. Hello, I'm Dave Cravassier, and right now on your 13 Action News Update. Today, a fact-finding review will take place into a shooting involving police in May of last year. That shooting resulted in the death of Justin Charland. Police say the 40-year-old was walking around Vegas Valley Drive and Lamb carrying a sword. Charland was shot and killed after police say he lunged at officers with that sword. Last month, the city of Las Vegas was given notice the Charland family would be filing a lawsuit against Metro for excessive use of force by the officers involved. New this morning, the newest 2021 Kids Count data, the report by the Annie E. Casey Foundation, tracks child well-being in the U.S. And according to the report, Nevada ranked 45th out of the top 50 states for overall child well-being. During the pandemic, Nevadans were performed, performed worse than the national average for households with children experiencing housing instability, food insecurity, limited access to health care. The report claims nearly a decade of progress in child well-being following the Great Recession is at risk of being erased. Today, more Garth Brooks tickets are going on sale. He's taking the stage at Allegiant Stadium July 10th. The concert was originally scheduled for last August, but was postponed because of the pandemic. Those extra tickets go on sale today at noon. All seats cost $95. A hot start to the week. Temperatures already 103 at noon, 107 at 4 p.m. Plenty of sun, also plenty of wind today. And the combo of the wind and the dry hot weather does elevate the fire danger. So be careful with cigarette butts. Red flag warnings in place both today and tomorrow. 111 a possibility up in North Las Vegas. How much wind? Well, about 35 mile per hour gusts today and 30 mile per hour gusts on Tuesday. 104 tomorrow. Now, we will see a little increase in humidity Wednesday and Thursday, fueling some temperatures. 10% storm chances middle of the week, dropping our temperature to 100 on Wednesday. Dave will dry out and heat right back up near 110 for the weekend. That's your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com, our KTNV mobile app, the Roku channel, and the latest version of Apple TV.